In this video I'm going to demonstrate a couple of new features that we just added to Web Starts and I hope you enjoy them. Uh, the first one is the ability to create a new page from the page selection drop down menu in the editor view. I'm in the editor view now and by clicking on this add new page link what I do is I launch the dialog box that allows me to add a new page to my site. From there I can make my selections whether I want to duplicate a page, create a blank page, whether I want the page to be a sub page and go on to a sub menu so on and so forth. So I'm gonna exit out of there but that's a small improvement, a little bit quicker and easier to get to uh, build a new page. You can still always click file, new or also the new page icon there. Uh, the other feature I want to show you is the ability to change to these new Google fonts in our uh, menu builder tool. So by selecting any menu and clicking the edit menu icon that appears when the menu is selected and then clicking continue through the styles you'll see that you'll have the option to choose a font style for your menu and we've added several new fonts but you can see even more fonts like up to uh, well over a hundred fonts if you click that uh, add more fonts link and then you can go through here and select whichever one that you want for this example I'm just gonna choose this one it's a little bit interesting looking and then I click continue and then it's applied to my menu uh, anytime that I save that I can view it on my live page and so that's a new feature is the ability to add those new fonts to the menu so it gives you a little bit of flexibility you can re really create an even more unique and compelling design now with web starts thanks to that feature don't forget to visit webstarts.com to see more helpful videos like this and of course build your very own free website